Good afternoon everyone, this is Henry, and as we get into tonight's video newsletter, I wanted to show you a setup here in Microsoft. So as we look at this off of a three-day chart, you know, I think we're starting to see some potential here. You've got the squeeze, you know, rolling in bullish favor, but really the, the thing here is that the chart is very sideways, right? I mean, it really has done essentially nothing since back here beginning in August. So there is that sideways nature to it. But with trading, there's always that art of trying to be just a little bit ahead of what the next move will be. And I'm of the opinion that, you know, traders may look at this and maybe like next week, you know, they wake up and think, oh gosh, you know, Microsoft is set to report earnings. And as that anticipation starts to build, I actually think you've got a little bit of a bid in here. Basically, if you can get above 420, that's the first big step in the right direction. 415 is the current hedge wall, and that's what I'm gonna be using as support. But if you can continue to find buyers in that area, the most interesting signals actually come here off of the 195 or even the 130 minute chart. I like both of those time frames as a unique way to divide the 390 minute cash session. And do you see how it takes a daily chart that is kind of nondescript and just really not setting up and does give you a setup here so the squeeze is the primary thing that I'm looking for to suggest that a directional move may be underway. And the way that I'm looking to play this is just buying the at the money calls for next week. You can even do a Delta 35, you know, something like that. It all depends on how the underlying moves. But if you can buy that at the money option and make about 30 to 40% on it, I think that's a decent swing trade. I think that's what's setting up over the course of the next week. And again, much below 415, I'll have to revisit that, but anything above that, you know, should provide for some pretty good trading. So I hope that helps. Do keep that in your watch list, and we'll see how it plays out into next week. Hey traders, this is Henry with simplertrading.com. I wanted to thank you for watching today's video. I hope you found it helpful, and if so, be sure to click the like and subscribe buttons down below. If you would like to also see me putting these ideas into action and trading my own account live in front of you, be sure to sign up at simplertrading.com and I hope to see you in the chat room sometime soon.